Hi guys, welcome to Office Blokes React. I'm Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm Office Bloke Dan. Collectively, really Office Blokes, aren't yes, we? we are. We yeah, are indeed. Correct. We are. Um, all now, together. Uh, all together in a room. It's true. Mashed together. So uh, who's going to take this one? <laughs> the intro. <laughs> I didn't pick it. <laughs> uh, I actually didn't put this in the watch later no, I did. either. Yeah, no, I did. So we recently reacted to the Indian Hell March video, which to be fair, kind of the title of the video was not the actual video, was it? It was like really dramatic music and yeah. it was more of a parade. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, it was to show the military might and mm. things like that. But it's more than that as well, though, wasn't it? There's more to it, yeah. It's more than just military might, I think, wasn't there? I think our sense yeah. of humor, I think our, reading some of the comments, I think our sense of humour went straight over the head of many. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. 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 And uh, if you look at our analytics, that video has gone out to a lot of people who don't haven't watched us before. Right. So there's a lot of unique viewers on there. And uh, yeah, I don't think some people got that we just take the piss out of everything on this channel. That is literally what we do. No one's safe. If anyone was safe, then it'd be wrong to take the piss out of yeah. someone. It's not a history not channel. It's not a knowledge channel. It's an entertainment yeah. value Have comedy. you not got a yeah. degree in history no, specialising in not British today. colonialism? <laughs> no, yeah. Oh, that, oh, I do have that one, yeah. Yeah, 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 so do I. We got all got, med- got a medal for it. <laughs> We all got uh, we all got <laughs> master's <laughs> degrees. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's if if you're easily offended because um, yeah. we do take the piss out of everything here, it. it's not the channel for you. Mm. So that that just is the way it is. Um, but that being said, we did ask a few questions on that video about because we didn't know yeah. a lot about the Indian military. Yep. We were speculating a bit about conflicts over the ra- last few decades potentially tensions with Pakistan on the border and things yeah so we're I mean we're China. here to ask there's some good com- there's some good comments as well though you know giving some Absolutely. decent information and you know going along yeah. with the flow and things like that and we're not experts putting in it straight that's fine watch videos and make jokes really that's but you know what we do yeah so, so uh, is this about Virat Kohli and Ben Stokes then <laughs> you well there was a few ben, there was a few Ben Stokes comments in there, in oh, there. Yeah. yeah so it wasn't all bad um but yeah so we're going to check out another video and let's educate ourselves a tiny little bit on the Indian military. Right, let's do it then. But we may take the piss at points, so uh, switch off <laughs> if you're easily offended. Yeah. Simple as that. This video contains images. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we take the piss out of Dave more than anything, don't we, sir? Correct. You know, to be fair. Yeah, <laughs> yeah precisely. Did they, they, they love Ben Stokes in India? Probably. They, they love cricket in India, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. Might not be their moment because we, you know, we, we beat them, didn't we, recently? So... Well, fair enough. Uh, well, <laughs> I was going to make a joke then, but I'm going to back out of that one and we will wait. Uh, so India versus UK military power comparison 2022. Let's do it. Wow. Is this the same channel? Because it's a it's proper the same epic. music, isn't it? Is it the same music? It sounds like the same <laughs> type of music, doesn't it? Yeah, it's very similar. There was, yeah. there was strings in it, so if there's like an orchestra section comes in in a minute, it's, it's very likely to be the same song. Yeah. They have a huge budget, though, aren't they? I mean, 70 odd billion. Well, ours was Which 68. Is more than yeah. Look at the population and take take money from the population to the budget, and you see which has got the biggest budget. Yeah, yeah so per we, head we head spend per more. Per capita, yeah. yeah. Mm. Yeah, but that 1.4 1, 1. billion population mm, is that's huge, just isn't it? crackers. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Yeah. It's a busy old place, India. Yeah. yeah. yeah been, well, you, been you've been a couple Delhi. of times, haven't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, in Mumbai. And uh, I think someone told me a stat one day that something like, I can't remember the number, someone will tell me in the comments, but I, th- I think it was one of the one of the um, <clears> cab drivers, <throat> he said to me something like, 11 million people arrive in Mumbai every day. Commute, like, you mean? Some people stay and some people go <coughs> go, go on yeah. somewhere else. Right, it's about eleven million people. When I went to the airport, man, to fly back, I was like, "How do you even get in this place?" Yeah, it was just mentally busy. <laughs> and I went, to, I just walked up to a door, and the guy went, "You can't come in here." I went, "Mate," I went, I showed him my ticket, and I was like, "Where am I supposed to go?" And he went, "You got to go and queue up." And I went, "Nah." So when he turned his back, he just bolted through the door, <laughs> <laughs> straight to check out, straight through. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Pre 
President Boris Johnson. President. Mm. Who's he? <laughs> We've had the thir- yeah. third one since then, aren't we? I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We've had a bunch since him. Yeah. Uh, not even a president. I know, yeah. <laughs> numbers are mind-boggling but it's such mm. a bigger area that's a huge area much actual massive borders to absolutely to especially with secure. pakistan yeah, yeah it's a huge and china <clears throat> and china yeah of course <clears throat> yeah yeah whereas we're a tiny little island where if someone did want to invade it's a, it's a much smaller border it's to volatile in that region yeah. isn't it i mean <clears throat> i'm sure i'm sure they're constantly watching each other yeah. You know, it's like uh, you know, the Russia are, watch- Russia are watching China sort of thing. China are watching Russia, and then you've got China looking at India, Pakistan looking at India, India going, "What the fuck are you looking at?" <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look the other way. You know, turn around, yeah, back yeah. off. Yeah, I think there's been a lot of tension with Pakistan over a lot with well, Pakistan over the years, major, hasn't there? Major you tensions, know, so but major tensions with China as well. I think. Is it really? Yeah, is there? I think so. Right, okay. I think it's like a, I think it's like a, it's a massive game of chess in that region. Yeah, you know, yeah. Sort of like st- strategically positioning all your like your troops and stuff. I mean, we've seen a, a video of how America do it. Yeah. Then again, America not really under any kind of like uh, th- imminent threat locally. Not from the Canada, border, Canada, Canada or Mexico are not going to look at invading. Uh, yeah, it's never going to happen. So their borders are not pretty, bo- pretty secure, aren't Russia's they? Russia's not far away across the Bering Strait, is it? Yeah, from USA. Yeah. Yeah, but you're going to be the temperatures and all out there. So, you know, even in the summer, where you're talking there, it's like you know, I don't think that's going to be a threat. threat that's going to, not going to be a local threat. Yeah, I don't. Think. Right. You might have a threat from Russia coming from the main part of Russia's going into, but that could be anywhere in the world. Plus, I yeah. mean, you'd see them coming for like three, exactly. yeah, three, all, four days. All <laughs> inches, yeah. it's all, all the, the the amount of border they've got this control. Is border, I mean, this it's border border control, huge, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely huge. So, it's an, so I guess there's a lot of tension between them because that that land grab areas where they, you know they're looking to sort of like facilitate any kind of land grab that could be in the know they've got to spend this kind of money because of the neighbours who they've got well yeah, if they, they, if numbers they didn't as well. get walked all over wouldn't they absolutely, absolutely. yeah they've got to show the strength and they've got to have a big big army haven't they yeah and what you've also got to remember as well is UK's a tiny little country and population if you take the population of what NATO is and put it against India for example yeah you see a difference of what we've got as you know, if, if India decided tomorrow they're going to invade the UK NATO gets involved and then you're fighting NATO you're not just fighting the UK yeah probably a more comparable population border lines yeah. and things like that than isn't yeah. it I suppose yeah. so which mm. is why NATO was kind of formed I guess is yeah. India a member of any sort of treaty like Don't that with so. any countries no I think they stand alone isn't there a isn't the one between Brazil and there's one with an acronym, Bricks. isn't there? Bricks. Is, is that what it is, or yeah. is that is that a trade? Brazil, treaty? Russia, India, China, and what was the S? South Africa. Is that trade no, no, though? Okay. That's not military. It's like it's, or? I don't think it's military. I think that's just trade. Or it was, they were like the BRIC countries were known as like the, you know, the developing nations, and these are you know, right. India's a major developing mm. nation. The way yeah. it's come from, what it's come from from 30 years ago to what it is today. Yeah, you know, it's a major nation. They're not talking about you know space mm. uh, exploration and all kinds of stuff where they didn't have that 30 years ago. But then you look at. Uh, I don't think I don't think India allows any foreign troops in their in their borders. Right. As well, I might be wrong on that. Let's know in yeah. the comments. But I don't think India allows anyone to have an air base or a, a military base. Yeah, they want to remain India. standalone. They sort of thing. Yeah, standalone. Yeah. I suppose mm-hmm. it could be an act of aggression. You know, if, if suddenly there's an American air base mm-hmm. well, on the, the border with Pakistan, the more a target, like for, the more a target for Russia and China, aren't they? So they probably think they're better off without it, really, yeah. and just you know, 
but I want to say that China, uh, India have made sort of like a uh, headway with like moving into like Southeast Asia, uh, partnering up with you know some of the some of the countries there mm. that lead up the side of China as well, to sort of like protect them from that side as well. So yeah. a bit like a you know a, an agreement in place maybe with uh, I don't know the Philippines maybe yeah. or you know places like Thailand, Laos, Vietnam. Yeah. Right, okay. Do you think if there was another major global conflict, it'd start in the east though instead of in Europe? Uh, if there was to be a World War Three, for example, it could be triggered by Pakistan trying to invade India and then allies uh, getting involved, or you know, yeah, well, like, what, it could be. I mean, everyone's <clears throat> everyone's got the sides on, aren't they? Yeah. there's no one, there's no one really neutral in in the, in the whole yeah, sort of like uh, just Switzerland. Even they're not <laughs> neutral. You know, if, if, if someone comes knocking on Europe, Switzerland will be right, standing right behind the USA. Yeah, you know, sort of like, well, oh yeah, yeah. Go on, I think India, 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 Pakistan would be an interesting one, wouldn't it? Yes, yeah, would. if people people. They've got certain allies, but I'm not sure whether those allies would actually want to get actively involved. No, well, I think Pakistan might sort of like jump on, on board, if you, especially if China, Iran, Russia sort of like start getting a little bit aggressive and start throwing the weight around with nuclear weapons and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Iran will jump on board with that. North Korea will jump on board with it. You might see Pakistan jump on board with it, and Pakistan will just direct everything towards India. Yeah. Then India are going to say, come on then, let's, we're going to have to dance now. Yeah, yeah. and that, that's why I thought we were allies with India, because they, they within that region... Are probably more it, if all those other countries banded together against mm. them you'd think that us and NATO and stuff would bolster India it's, it's a funny one because we've got strong relations with India and Pakistan haven't we you know, we've got strong. massive yeah. you know, Indian Pakistan population over here haven't yeah. we yeah, absolutely. huge you know, I, I, so we've got a prime minister whose absolute, heritage comes from India you know we've got a, a hell of a lot of ties with them so you know mm. we're uh, sort of allies really aren't yeah. we yeah that's what i thought until i read the comment section and everyone's like we're, we're, we're gathering our forces to invade the uk and it's like <laughs> yeah. come okay. on mate <laughs> good luck argentina tried that with a little tiny island look what happened <laughs> <laughs> if they buy a lot of our stuff possibly so we've got like BAE systems and yeah. people like that we're a big yeah. arms exporter I wonder if they they use some of our gear I'm yeah, surprised at that yeah. fire aircraft 157 our fire aircraft I'm surprised at that but again it's it's not we're not we're not one unit anymore no we're, we're sort of like a coalition of yeah. uh, NATO and even yeah. like you know, uh, you know other, other allied forces as well yeah but you've got like you know, it's, it doesn't matter we've got 157 in, in, in the pot yeah, but that's just fighter yeah. aircraft. So there's going to be we've done all the logistics yeah, stuff yeah, and everything yeah, else yeah. that goes behind yeah. it. There's yeah, going to yeah, be tons yeah. more. That. I've not seen them before. I'm assuming yeah. they're there to knock out uh, sort of, yeah. power stations or something, or <clears throat> communication plants, electronic something warfare. like that. Or is it a battery-powered plane? As like stupid a, as that may sound, like a drone. Well, I, d I don't know because we've, we've got more than one drone. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Not sure about Let's that. Look that <laughs> Thank you. 
fairy mm. one. Yeah. Yeah. Then, uh, yeah, that's the, uh, I don't know, that's when you, it's the, it's the last, uh, it's all over. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's the last decision, that one, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know. What it's what it's uh, interesting, that. It's it is very interesting. It's kind of what we'd expect, though, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Based off the size of the country, the population. Yeah. yeah. You'd expect it to be. Ge ge geographical location. Yeah. You know, you'd expect it to be <clears> able to defend itself from, like I say, its noisy neighbours. Yeah, there's multiple to, uh, countries around there as well, isn't there? You know, yeah. bordering them. So yeah. uh, we're sort of lucky in that sense that we are an island, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Like I say, we're, we're members of NATO. I have not you know, it's, you know it's, it's flexing a little bit. And so like I say, you know, we're ranked in, you know, for us to be ranked eight, I think that's quite high. Yeah. You know, for the size of a country us, and yeah. population yeah. and that. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But, but we're also like one of the... Like fourth or fifth biggest economy in the world, aren't we? Yeah. For a little island. Yeah. Yeah. But one of the one of the things I'd, I'd like to know in the comments as well on this um, is uh, <coughs> how old is how old is the uh, military hardware they've got? I was thinking you know, of the that. helicopters, the planes, yeah. you know, the ships, yeah, yeah. and all that kind of stuff. What sort of age range are they? At? What what condition are they in? You know, are the old Russian fleets that they, they bought from Russians? You know, are they brand new bought from you know, the the yeah. USA manufacturers or whatever? It'd be interesting to know because you've got like the Saudi military and stuff that spend mm. tons on all the best gear, yeah. don't they? And yeah. Like you see Very the stand strong. there. Yeah. So who knows? Yeah. Mm, yeah. But yeah. So let's see if we can get this video to 45 trillion likes. Make sure you head down there, press the like button and uh, go and join. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.